lie. Some might say it's off season here in Aspen, Colorado, but kitchen concerts has been on lately and we are continuing today with 18 year old we got a little one in the kitchen today elise tro how you doing elise i'm doing great how are you doing i am doing really well stoked to have you in here today playing tonight at the belly up with moonchild you ready or what yeah totally super excited you've uh, you've done a few cho- shows with moonchild so far what do you uh, what do you think of that uh, Moonchild, I've been a fan of them for over a year now. I first saw them in LA, and so I'm super excited to be on the tour with them. We looked at the billing, we saw them, amazing band, and then we saw you. I actually saw your Jimmy Kimmel performance a little while back, and we said, we, we got to get this girl in somehow. This girl is incredibly talented, and uh, here we are, so we're, we're stoked you stopped in. Oh, cool. Thanks so much for having me. The, uh, the looping thing, we got to get into that, obviously. You do, uh, you do a lot of your own stuff, but you do some amazing covers over on YouTube, everything from, uh, from Foo Fighters to Radiohead. How'd you, uh, how'd you get into the whole kind of looping concept? Uh, I started looping last, uh, in November of 2017, so just a couple months ago. And um, I guess I, I wanted to make a video that showcased uh, myself playing different instruments without having to um, cut it up, so to show that it is live recorded live. So that's kind of where the live looping came into play. Uh, so just being a multi-instrumentalist and wanting to portray that through a video, um, that's why I got into the whole live looping. And you just said some instruments, like it's no big deal, but you play every single instrument on here. It's so <laughs> impressive. How, uh, what was the first one you started off learning? Uh, I started off on piano when I was six and I took classical lessons. And then uh, I started playing drums when I was 10 and that sort of took over my whole life. And uh, piano kind of fell away for a bit, and then I picked it back up, and I started uh, playing guitar and bass as well. Right on. Well, uh, I guess some of the some of the covers you're doing, 18-year-olds are listening to Top 40 radio usually, and y- you're going to Radiohead, to The Police. You even do a Sinatra cover. How do you get into these uh, these kind of older, more classic bands? Uh, I guess a lot of the, the music that I'm into, uh, my drum teachers introduced to me, and uh, a lot of the Top 40s music doesn't really have drumming, uh, like acoustic drumming on it. So I listened to a lot of older stuff to get inspiration for beats. And then that sort of became my music taste. So a lot of the music that I listen to is based on um, the music that I like to drum. Well, let's, uh, it's great stuff. Check out the YouTube videos for the looping. But uh, we got you on the keys today. And we're just going to do uh, a super simple stripped down performance today. What are we doing? I'm playing a song called Catch My Breath. All right. Here's Elise Tro in the kitchen. Yeah. 
to me Elise Tro in the KSPN kitchen. That was beautiful. Nice work. Thank you. So good to have you in here. And thank you for taking a gigantic step backwards. You were just on Kimmel a couple months ago, and now you're in the kitchen. So thank you very much. Your KSPN kitchen concert brought to you by Guitar Center, Aspen 82, and Aspen Brewing Company. Guitars from D'Angelico. Guitars. You're listening to KSPN.